I'm Jack Smolinoff here with Red Solutions and today I'm very excited to show you the new to market Vector HD 580. Now a lot of you guys probably haven't seen this drone as it is new to market, but I wanna talk about some quick specs, go over the drone with you, show some of the sweet components that this drone is bringing to market. Look at the chargers, the battery, and the controller to show you why this is gonna be the next biggest drone on the market. So some quick specs to talk about is first, this is an 18.5 gallon tank, gonna be right up there with the other market leaders. So right up there in the gallon capacity. Spreader wise, 166 pounds of payload. So a really big spreader, gonna be able to cover a lot of acres with the spreading package as well. Moving over here, it's only a four motor drone. So no more eight motors, really simple. If it does go down, we have less parts to fix. So that means cheaper repair bills. Next thing I wanna show here is the motor ESC um, combination. This is the biggest ESC currently on the market for drones, uh, also paired with the motor. You have 76 inch propellers to obviously keep your drone moving at a efficient rate in the field. Next, moving down to the nozzles. So this drone is capable of adding up to four nozzles, but the standard package is two, and that's gonna allow you to do all your two gallon and your regular work. So we have obviously your spinner down here, you have your check valve and your hose coming down, and then you have your motor that spins in here with along your ESC, and as you can see. If you hit this on a trailer, it's not gonna break. There, there is some bend here, so don't worry about it if it, it is a durable unit. Next thing that I really wanna talk about is the pumps. On a lot of the other systems, you have to unbolt them, unscrew them, and do a lot of different things to go into your pump. If you're spraying with big, heavy products, you might actually plug your pumps on some other systems and you might have to open them up. Here is a very quick and simple process. So, like I said, no screws. All you're gonna do is turn, release. That's your whole pump. And you can even pull this part of it out right here. So really, really, really simple. And then all we're gonna do is go right into here and then walk. So very simple, no screwing, just pull it out and clean it. Next thing I wanna talk about is coming over here is the radar. So as you see, a lot is different is your radar is at the bottom of the drone. In our testing, in our early testing with this model, we've been able to fly at 13 foot, 30 mile an hour and do some pretty nasty hills and it keep going right up with no obstacle avoidance, not stopping. So gonna be a very efficient machine in the hills. The final thing I wanna talk about, I guess, on parts, and these will be the accessories of the drone, is what I actually like the most about the Vector HD 580 is gonna be its charger and battery. So other systems on the market, we're either charging in water or we have two separate units. You have to charge your battery and then put it in a cooling station here. It's all in one. So we're gonna take the battery which is vented with air sockets along here. So that's gonna allow your air to push right through where a lot of other batteries don't have that. We can just have the cooling go right through it while it's in the front of the drone. So set down right in here, locks into place. It will immediately start charging. With your charger, you have adjustable voltages. It'll go down in 500 watt increments from 9,000 all the way down to 500. So really adjustable, all it is at the click of a button. Obviously, obviously it's not on, but you click the minus, it will go down, kick the plus, it will go up. So really, really, really simple. The next thing is, is the battery placement on the drone. So a lot of the other systems, like I mentioned, you're putting your battery back here, hiking it up really tall and on a long day, spraying a lot of acres, that gets tiring here. Front of the drone, lock right in and power it on. So a lot lower, but easier to put in. And after a long day of spraying, that's gonna be a lot easier on your arms over a long day. Next thing I'm gonna do is power on the drone and show you some features on this controller. So we're gonna power on the controller. And what you'll notice on this controller is that the features are a lot similar to I would say the DJI users that this is gonna be really of interest to you. This is not, it's not the same, but it's gonna be very similar. And after running this drone over a quite a bit of acres already, I have really noticed the ease of use of this controller and the drone. A lot of similarities to DJI, but I think a lot of features that take it above and beyond of what we're used to. So 
As you can see your home screen, you have your, your 580, you have all of your other settings. I'm gonna hit start. So here's your map, obviously. So you're gonna have your gallons that go from 0.1 all the way up to 18.5. Camera, which is down here, protected. So if the drone does go down, we're not gonna have to worry about the camera getting broken. Where the others have gimbals, we're inside the drone, we're protected. So it's a completely adjustable camera, just like I, just right here. To wrap up here, I'm gonna fold in the drone to show you how that process is and how compact it is. We're gonna power off the drone. If you want to learn more information about the new Vector HD580, please go to redsolutionsne.com to learn more information or to get into contact with us to schedule a demo.